Hi, I'm Charles Cross, and we're here at Lake Tahoe today using an ROV running the Mission Robotics Software Electronics Package to survey and document the sunken seaplane. Using the event marking and dive replay features of our Navix piloting software, we'll demonstrate how to mark features of interest in real time, review your dives on site, and quickly post process and analyze the data to create comprehensive reports. All right, we're at the target. You see that this is a Lake LA4 amphibian, and as it sunk, it rolled over. It's actually upside down right now. What you're looking at is the underside of the nose. It's the sort of the bow of the hull. So let's go ahead and mark that. This is a good view. Okay. So to explore that first, why don't we try and figure out why it sank? Let's do a straight ahead pass at the hull and see if there's a uh, break. Uh, see if we can find where there are breaks in the hull where it might have uh, taken on water. So here you see the nose gear doors. And then as you go along the hull, what's that? Is that a, is that just a, is that actually a seam in the hull or is that, no, it doesn't. Something black on the outside. Of and black on the outside, but it doesn't look like a, put a marker there. tear in the hull. Okay. Let's keep going. Now that looks like a problem. And I wonder if that's what sunk in. So. Oh yeah. Whoa. <laughs> that's a problem with the hull. So. All right. Definitely put a marker there. Definitely put a marker there. Keep going. And keep going back. The rest of this. It looks like these may have been patches from earlier in the life of the plane. Okay. Um, where they had leaking water and then patched over it. But that big hole is, must have been what sank the thing. So here you see the rivet lines on the aft part of the hull. Nice. We're back to the rudder now. All right, so here you have a view of the end numbers of the airplane. So let's go ahead and mark that as a target. Like on here, you see the underside of the wings. You can see the retractable and gears up in its wells. So one shot that's going to be interesting is looking into the cockpit. Oh, there's all kinds of fish in there. Nice. So here's the cockpit, mark that. Oh, the seat just kind of tumbled out there. <laughs> yeah, it's, I think is that the remains of the co-pilot seat or is that the rear seat? That must be the co-pilot's seat. Yeah, there's two there, there's one upside down there. And... Nice. Yeah, so now that we have uh, taken a look at the hull, let's take a look at the engine details. Uh, a Lake Amphibian has a pusher engine mounted on a pedestal above the airplane. And so since the airplane's upside down, you see that it's on the, on the lake floor here. So this is it. Uh, it's a good shot. You can take a mark of that. It's It's a four-cylinder engine. Here you see the, the valve covers on one side. Right. Nice. Nice. And if you can safely get back, we can view the v details of the propeller. There you go. Nice. There we go. There's our propeller hub. Looks like there's a little part yeah. number plate or something. Yeah, like that. there's the dry threads. Yeah, something about the maintenance details of it. But that's the propeller hub and the flywheel with the starter ring for it. 
so perhaps we should back outwards and do a, a general survey of the site and you can mark on that process starts. Is that our tether going underneath it? Or is no, that that's uh, the, that's a that's cable antenna one. wire or some sort of cable? Back up a little bit. Okay. go into okay. stabilize mode and this will help us do yeah. orbit around here. Here you see the wing float on the starboard wing and it looks like it's become detached and it's fallen over to the side. Nice, nice little orbit of everything. All right, let's take a look at this footage, make sure we got all the shots we need. Mm -hmm. Okay, so if we jump ahead, so here's where we arrive. Saw the airplane. Plane, and then nice. this is the here's first the patch. That's not the leak source, but. And then the next the thing. Next one, is there the is the hole in the hull. Good. We can go. So there's the. In number four. Cockpit. Nice. And here's the engine details. Got a couple of markers on the engine. The prop hub, another view of the engine. Okay, this is the start of the tour. And we can kind of seek through this. And this is where we started coming back up. Excellent.